Oh! So this is, this is still a thing that happens. Oh yeah. Hi! Sorry I've been away for a bit. If you want to know what I've been up to, then I'll post a video on my second channel. But this week I want to try something new, I want to try something different. Um, I've always wanted to try this on YouTube, so um, without further ado, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna take you to Joel in the kitchen. Joel, are you there? Yes, I am in the kitchen where my inner lady parts feel at home. So I've always wanted to make things on YouTube, like a cooking thing. Um, AKA burning my house down, because that's an interesting video, alright? But I thought I'd start things off by just making something simple, but apparently something I'm quite good at. Um, apparently I make quite good hot chocolates. For this recipe, you will need some sugar, pixie tears, bees tears, either dark or, or light chocolate, you know, racial equality. And not to mention, milk. From a cow's titty. And of course a kettle. First you need to cook. Because I'm a British vlogger, because I'm British, because I was born in Britain, I feel like you need the constant reminder that I'm British, and this is a British vlog. So you know what? We're gonna go for London taxis and London buses. Now I'm hunched over. Start off with, um, choose your hot chocolate mix. I'm probably gonna choose this one, you know, because... No races on my next channel. Put three to four in. Teaspoons, that is. That's just when you get your sugar! Before I continue this video, I feel like I should need to say something. I bet some of you are wondering, does Joel swear when he puts sugar in hot chocolate? No, I only do that when I make tea. It's a condition I have called T-Rets. I am so done with the internet. So I have two sugars in here, or however many you want, you know, you could... You could have three if you're feeling a bit buck wild. Or if you're already sweet enough, then you don't have to have any, do you? Bastard. Stir it all in until it's like an even thing until you can't see the sugar anymore. Look, can you see sugar in there? No, no you cannot. Genius. You know what, I'm gonna add a bit of this in my chocolate because I feel like I'm being racist if I'm not. Racial equality for everyone that was brought up correctly. Table. It's fine. Everything is fine. Stare it <laughs> This is where we turn the kettle on and wait for it. I feel like we need some music here. Never mind, I'll find someone like you. And then you just pour it in without burning yourself, you know? Because it's happened before. And then you just pour it just, just to three quarters of the way. And then we stir. This is where you add my favourite ingredient cow titty! Milk. However you have milk you want it, just, just add it up to that. Because, you know, this is when we add these gems. This is basically vanilla extract and honey. Unfortunately, their legal names are not pixie tears and honey tears. Sorry, amazing Phil. So then you just add just just a, just just half a teaspoon in. You know you, you don't want to go spray with this because it's actually quite lethal. If you had too have too much, it won't kill you. You know you, you just make your cup taste like pixie. Shit. And then put it away because you don't want to get shouted at by your parents. And then honey. Woo! Oh, I'd say a full teaspoon of honey. Get in. Get in. At this point, you usually would add whipped cream and marshmallows, but, um, no, um, we are against whipping cow titties. Make one yourself, if you've got all the ingredients, and then just tell me what you think. Jesus Christ! That's all for today's Calooster video, see you next week guys, bye! Look at this at the bottom! After I washed it out, look at that!
Oh. Oh no. When I told you pick these shits, I weren't kidding.